Hi, so it is the 4th of January and this is my little pump working away. It uh, is a one and a half volt um, pump and it's just uh, because I don't have electric set up near here I want to show you how the airlift pump works uh, for the vertical pallet planter. So the vertical planet, the pallet planter is uh, 7 inches wide which is I know about uh, 18 centimeters wide and I haven't any major planted in it yet there's a couple of uh, strawberries I brought in so here's about the speed of the water so it's uh, substantial and any any bubble pump for an aquarium for a little indoor aquarium will give this speed and this should be going over here to the middle of it but um, just at the moment it's just to show you guys so I'm not too worried about that anyway here's how it's dripping down at the moment so it's not uh, obviously if it was in the middle it would be over here it would be better because it would be coming down more on or even at this far end it would be, be better because it would be getting more of the plants and it's dripping down so here it's dripping mostly at the back. There's a little drip was coming here, but that, oh yeah, there we go. So there's one little drip there, but um, when we direct it to the back, it'll all be coming down the back. Then as we go down here, a little drip down here, and somewhere along here, I'm not too sure. But anyway, um, oh, sorry, just got to get around here. So um, here is how the air lift coming up. Uh, oh yeah, I'm just going to slow it down for you. I have a little, apparently with this particular type of pump you're not supposed to slow them down, but I'll slow it down for a few minutes. So I've just got this little thing here to slow down the air. So we're slowing it right down. And all it means is that your air lift works slower. I'll see how slow I can get. So I've gotten really slow now. You see the water is still coming up, it's just coming up slower and he's going to make it to the top yeah makes it to the top so um, anyway there it is slower just go slower and um, depending on your type of pump you can do this or not just depends some of them they don't advise you to slow them down some some are fine with it anyway it's back up to speed now now i want to show you the bottom of it so there's tons of ways of doing the bottom of these things and I just got this piece of wood in so this is about I think it's 11 or 12 or 13 inches high so this is how I have done this one no nothing too fancy uh, I have this uh, here uh, to join the two tubes so it, it's a quarter inch internal diameter tube going up this join because it was um, I made a mistake in, in length and uh, this is just for fitting I used a larger one to fit the tube and the same thing here and here so um, when you're getting your quarter inch pipe you might be advisable to get a, a foot um, like I get it down at the hardware store to get about a foot long of something that's a bit bigger you should be getting, maybe get all your equipment together at the one time and just make sure that things fit inside each other now this was vital to it working was to make something to slow down the water going in to this because so this is the water this is the air going in that's the water going in and this was the water going up through the air lift if you don't slow it down I might as well show you what happens okay sorry one-handed operation here so so now this will the water will come in as fast as it was so sometimes the water bubbles out so the water is still going to the top at the moment uh, so, oh, uh, but you see some of it sometimes it bubbles out sometimes it makes it to the top and sometimes it just kind of it's unreliable that's what I'm trying to say here I guess see now it's 
uh, it might even be the same amount coming up but you're getting all this bubbling at the bottom and it can stop and uh, it's still coming up this time this is new tubing as well but see, see it's um, it's, it can misbehave pretty dr dramatically uh, it seems to be okay now but definitely I would say if you want reliability like you'll get more air coming up right now but it's all sorts of like we're getting all this bubbling down here and see here it's it can stop. It's a, it's a, it's just a pain. So if if you put in something, oh, I'm not walking on it. If you put in something like this at the bottom, you just get more reliability, uh, just to restrict the water flow to something close to what it can take, rather than you know a massive amount. Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. I hope uh, I hope it's understandable. Thanks. Bye bye.